For any Xbox or PlayStation codes or cheap games on any platform, use the referral link in the description. It'll take you to G2A.com. Use the promo code CHEZ over there and you'll get yourself 3% cash back. For all No Identity merchandise, hats, hoodies and t-shirts, follow the link in the description down below to the No Identity Fan Fiber website. Hey, yeah. Uh... Right, bearing in mind the various different places we want to improve. Oh, it's saving again, bloody hell. I think I've, I think I've set my FM, because I kept getting crash dumps, I think I've set my FM to save every two weeks now rather than every month. I might alter, no, I still don't trust it not to crash dump. <laughs> Right, when you offer a transfer suggestion, give me full name, or at least first name and surname, and position as well, please. Because obviously with it being FM, there are bound to be multiple, multiple people with the same name. Right, uh, still offers coming in for size. I'm just going to say reject all offers for him. One, right backs, left backs, right mids, left mids, strikers, centre backs. James Tavernier, right back, Rangers. I do know that he's decent. Carey's signing, that's good news. He's in, that is a winger. And Cam and centre mid. Sort, sorted. It's also a can of iron brew. Sorted and all. Curiously, or just out of curiosity, sorry. Where are they playing Carey? They're playing him on the left. That's where I was thinking of playing him. Although we do have Mate, but he would be a squad player. That's a good signing for us, I think. I'm quite pleased with that. Right, what did we say? Uh, Tavernier. Tavernier, presumably. Uh, 4.8 million is a lot of money. That is expensive. Have a look at Rangers, actually. I know that Alfredo Morelos, Morelos sorry, is a good player. 8.25 million, though. Bear in mind, we're going to want him to. We are going to want to bring in multiple people. So, I can't really afford to splash like five, six mil on one player. I just don't. I just don't have the money for that. Not at this stage. Um, Adam Nagy. Oh, I don't think I'll be able to afford him. Pretty certain. Valued at six million, he wouldn't want to come to a League One. Bear in mind, we're in League One as well. You have to keep that in mind too. Players are going to want to have to drop to the third tier in England to join us. I could ch check the transfer list to start off with. Yeah, you're right, Luke. Luke, Luke Harris. Sorry, it's a mixture of Luke and Harris in the same word. Luke. All right, Luke. How's it going? <laughs> Hi Chu, sorry if he's way too good, but last year on FM he wasn't, so please check Tilo Kaira from Schalke. K. Tilo. £22 million. Pounds. Yep, too good. So was... uh, Jaden Anthony. Oh look, another centre mid. You are obsessed. Oh no, he's a right sided midfielder. I was going to say, you are obsessed, Jez. Strength of 1 to 7. Cancel. So was mate.
Charlie Carter or Reese Grego Cox? Decent potential, but don't know how they are on your save this far into the future. I'm going to hazard a guess, Foxy, that they are uh, Woking players. Charlie Carter. Chelmsford. Formerly of Woking. Shit. Uh, what was the other one? Reese Gregor Cox. Reese Gregor Cox. Currently at Port Vale. Formerly of. Oh, not Woking. Alright, players. Still shit. Sorry. <laughs> no! Uh, yeah, I know the loan deal is looking to end soon. Bath one. A bat. A Bamaniqua. Oh, he was on loan this year as well. Alright, yeah, I'm, I'm quite happy to extend that key player. Not selected. Yeah, okay. Dartford wanting to extend Phil Willard's loan as well. Sure. Uh, Cottage players you need to look at. They're not going to be good enough, man. Uh, Dickenso. Brennan Dickenso. Average and isn't performing crucially. Uh, let me just scroll up slightly. Sammy Schm Jesus Schmoodix. Oh. Nope. Lapsley. Lapsley. A winning midfielder. Where did Colchester finish in the league this year? 20th. So that none of their players are really going to be or going to have been in that good a form. I'll scout him. And what was the other one? Frankie Kent, centre-back. Frankie Kent. It's just not good enough. Bear in mind, we're wanting to get promoted out of League One and then hopefully have players that are available or good enough to at least survive in the Championship as well. Osco Melendo. Oscar, sorry. Oscar Melendo. Mm, centimetre Espanol. £1.8 million is his valuation. That is affordable. Get a scout report. Currently playing in La Liga, though. And they just qualified for Europe. Espanol, didn't they? Uh, Dominic Samuel. Dominic Samuel's a good shout, actually. Dominic Samuel from Blackburn, if he's still there. He's at Portsmouth now. And banging goals in. What's his valuation? 650k. I definitely... Because in my off-stream save, I started at Blackburn and Dominic Samuel scored me a lot of goals. So I would definitely be interested in Dominic Samuel. Jonathan Lecco. Uh, he's on loan from West Brom. That was in the Championship last year. I mean, I'll scout him, but I don't think I'm going to be able to afford him. And I don't think he'd want to drop down as far as... Um, League One, Anthony Robinson. Left back at Maidstone. Oh, come on, mate. He's quick. He's got good physicals, but his technicals don't look that good. I'll get a scout report because he's only 22, but I don't think he's going to be good enough. Connor Chaplin. He's at Shrewsbury. Scored one goal in one game for them last year. Does that mean he was significantly injured? It does not. It just means that they didn't use him at all. I'll get a scout report. He's valued at £19,000. Did he do anything at Portsmouth? Not really. Shrewsbury had a good season as well. Yeah, they got promoted. Didn't they? But at least... They got promoted? Yeah, they won their playoffs. Who was the top goal scorer? Omar Bogle. Paid sixty-four grand for him. And he scored 20 goals for him. Scout report. Greg Lua, 25 years old. Get a scout report. Might be a good idea, actually, when it comes to strikers. Let's just have a look at stats. Uh, player overview. Top goal scorers. Uh, what? Oh, player detailed. Games one, games last set of cards, appearances. 
attacking goals. Mark Cullen scored 32 goals last year. But I know from CJ's experience, Mark Cullen doesn't necessarily do that every season. Uh, John Arango, I don't think I'll be able to afford him. I'll have a look. Let me just quickly check this list. Tuba Akpom, I don't, I don't like Tuba Akpom. I really don't. I smacked him in this year. I just, I think I'd be too... I mean, it's just one season of goal scoring. They're at 32. Jaden Stockley, he did score against us. It's weird that he scored more goals in League Two, in League One, sorry, than he did in League Two. Will Grigg signed for us, of course, and Danny Rose, but neither of them really scored much many goals for us. 20-year-old on loan from Crystal Palace, Mitchell Candlin. Get a scout report on him. I c let me just out of curiosity, actually, firstly, let me look at Arango. I'll get a scout report on him. Then, uh, let's have a look at the youth players at Chelsea. Is there anyone we might look to loan? Ben House scored goals out on loan. That was at Tranmere. Uh, Shamar Moore scored, oh, was it Braintree? This is around the 23s. It's actually it's sort by uh, reports, ability. There isn't really anyone that stands out. I'm looking at my own fucking under 23s, that's why. Dick etches. I'm so stupid sometimes. <laughs> Chess, that's your under 23s. Yeah, I just figured that. I just. My brain is just not working. Right, who's called goals here? Under 23s. Pedro is in there under 23s. 32 year old Pedro. Won't be signing him. 36 year old Jonas. Won't be signing him. I guess this is CJ telling me they're my under 23s. Uh, Here's a reminder about how good Eddie and Nketiah was. Oh, yeah, that's a good shout, actually. Let me just check that. Nketiah. Unlike Eddie, is at Rotherham. Scored five goals in 33 games in the championship. I'll get a scout report, but I really don't think he's going to be worth it on this save. Uh, Nathan. I was on loan at Vitesse. Would be incredible for me in a 4-2-3-1, but I'm thinking I want to prioritise a 4-4-2. Why is everybody not in position order? Tammy wouldn't come this. Tammy wouldn't come down to League One now. Uh, Josh Phillips, where was he scoring goals? Scunthorpe, League One. Get a scout report on him. It's a shame I can't have a look at reports, but Never mind. Uh, Luke McGee for goalkeeper. Uh, McGee, Luke McGee. Is it Sheffield United and first team? I mean, his first team in the Champo. I don't. I don't think he'd want to sign for me. Uh, Josh Vela for centre mid is a good shout. Pff, I can't afford that. Let me just have a quick look through the reserves at Chelsea with potential for potential loans, and then we'll contemplate why is he must have been injured. Yeah, groin strain at the end of the season, um, and then we'll then I'll come back to the chat. So just hold off with the with the bits for a minute because I, I won't be looking at what you're suggesting just for the moment. Hudson Adoy on loan at Fulham, wouldn't really want to drop as far as me. That was on loan at FC Twenty. He's a Regen. Dyshawn Radan. Actually, no, he's not a Regen, is he? Get scout report. Nine hundred twenty-five pound. Oh, we're not. What else are we looking at? We're looking at we're wanting to look at defenders as well, aren't we? Wing backs or right backs. Oh god, Zappa Costa, why click on his name, Church? You know he's not gonna to come to you. Right backs and left backs. Jada Silva. He was on loan at Middlesbrough in the Premier League, so he's not gonna to come to League One. Dan Lo Pereira, well, what's he doing at Chelsea? Via PSG. Forty seven million they paid for him. Daniele Regani's in there under twenty threes as well. What is going on at Chelsea? Okay, I said hold off on the bits, but you can Donate another one if you want. 
Uh, wait, chess mode is ignoring bits. Chess mode is a plum. Well, hey, hi, chat. <laughs> uh, I don't know anything about you. Michael Hector. Wasn't he at Reading? Yeah. He's on he was on loan at Derby, oh, Derby in the Premier League, but they got relegated. I'll get a scout report, Michael Hector. Maybe we could consider buying him back if you might be interested in joining me. Dujon Sterling. He's quick, but I don't know what he's tackling's like. Trevor Chaloba, would he be willing to come to me? He was on only Ipswich and the Champo and did terribly. So I'm not sure even I'd want him if he would come to me. Jonathan Russell. Is there anybody here that really stands out? I don't think so. Not wide midfielders. Sam Taylor. Strength of two to eight. Doesn't exactly fill me with confidence. Sam Wilson we have Juan Castillo Lona Excelsior See Sam Wilson was on loan at me but he just mm. I don't know man It sucks that he won't extend his loan uh, oh, Hold him if you Oh Stand low parameters Just clicked on him That's Kante Jake Clark Salter would be decent maybe on loan at Rotherham had a decent season, would probably be good enough for League One, almost certainly. Mason Mount. Reese Deacon. Scout you. Acceleration of 4 to 10 doesn't fill me with confidence. I like players to have decent physicals as well as good technicals. Tackling of 2 to 8, you're not exactly a holding midfielder, are you? Um. I don't know, is, is, is anyone here worth taking at Chelsea at the minute? There was that cam from Everton, wasn't there? But I need I need wide players. Uh, right, let me divert attention back to the chat. We'll try a couple of players that you guys are recommending. Zelly Ishmael. Oh, Zelly, he was on loan at Cambridge a couple of years ago. He was decent. We'll have a look at Zelly for the right-hand side of midfield. Z Zelly. Ishmael, he's on, is it Black? right now in League One and then at Cambridge for a year I actually really like Sally Ishmael let's get a scout report Divine Nah D okay I catch an ado with the eight months in a row thank you very much am I spelling it right it's Divine isn't it Oh, it's D-I-V. Oh, it's D -I -V. Divine. Ah, no. No. Nope, doesn't exist. Sorry, bro. Uh, I mean... I don't know whether Luke Garbutt would... He's still in the under twenty threes at Everton. Would he consider coming down to me? Maybe he was on loan in the Championship. Get a scout report. He's valued at sixty k, but his wages are very high. But he is. Ugh. Let's maybe hold off on that. Sam Manton for centre mid. I'm not sure whether he'd leave Barnsley. Would he, Sam Manton? Ryan Leonard we can look at. Onya Dimmer we could look at as well. Onya Inmar. Not playing in the Championship. How was he in League One? Uh, well, they've been in the Championship the entirety of this save. Lucky. He's not been playing for him though, so it's something we could look at. Except, goodbye. Uh, and Manton we were going to look at. Oh, is it Blackpool now? He was at Barnsley, wasn't he? Oh, it was Walsall, not Barnsley. I was thinking of a previous save on FM. I knew I had him somewhere. Uh, he'd be alright, but he's again, he's not like promotion and survive material. He's playoffs and if you get promoted, get immediately relegated material. Adam Bartlett is... He's going to be what, far too old now, isn't he? Is it Darlow? He's in his mid-30s. Yeah, Adam Bartlett's going nowhere. Was, did play one game for Cambridge on loan. And uh, we lost the player final. So cheers, Adam. 
uh, 300 bits from... I can't read your name there because it's the wrong colour font. 400 bits from Frabri. Uh, love you, Ramos and Southampton Korea Motor. Watch them every day and help me through tough days. Thank you for all you do. Keep it up. Thank you, mate. Thank you for the bits. Hopefully things improve for you, my man. Glad they uh, give you some sort of escape. That's what YouTube is best at. Or best used for. Is that cloth is at Swansea? Yeah, he's, uh, he's not going to cut me, is he? Tavares. Please don't uh, spam in all caps, though. Huh. Was it her? Huh? Herimberto Tavares. Hernani Tavares. Heriberto. Let me try Heriberto. Heriberto. Uh, no, there is no Heriberto Tavares. Soz. Is a key, is key though. <laughs> I think you'll find that scum is York. Uh, I don't know what scum you're on about. Matt O'Reilly sent him with Fulham. Oh, God. O'Reilly. Matt O'Reilly. Matt, 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 Matt. Matt O'Reilly. 19. He played nine games. He's he's getting some first team football at Fulham in the Champo. We'll have, we'll have to wait and see. Uh, Oliver Norwood could be a good shout. I'm not sure whether it. Oh, okay. I hadn't clicked on the thing by pressing space bar advanced. I was going to check the uh, short, uh, transfer list as well, wasn't I? Just to see who was on there. Uh, what was I going to look at? Oliver Norwood. That was it. Oliver Norwood. Value of 300k, his wages are quite high. Is it Fluminense? Is that Fluminense? Flu? Yeah, he's at Fluminense. What is Oliver Norwood doing at Flu? Pardon me, Fluminense. Bloody hell. Uh, right, scouting transfer players. Uh, clear. New search. Transfer listed. Okay. Interested in transfer. Then let's edit search and look for a right backs to start off with. We'll work our way through. Richard Tate at Motherwell, formerly of Cambridge United. I'm not sure if he's... To be fair, on FM he looks decent. I'm not sure whether I'd want to sign him. Not for 2.4 million. I'll get a scout for though, just in case. Uh, Syriac Riviere. Ooh! Hello. I'd be interested in him. I'd be very interested in him, actually. Jordan Clark, Shrewsbury, eh. He's alright, but I think the other guy's better. We'll get a scout report there just in case. Uh, Nathan Thompson at Preston. Okay, I'll get a scout report, but I'm not sure. And then we're down to a few shit houses. Bino. No. Uh, right. Left back. Stink. Okay. Lee Wallace. He's transfer listed. I would definitely consider Lee Wallace. He's probably 32, 33 now. 32. I definitely consider Lee Wallace though. I know he is a very capable left back. Andrew Taylor. Not th of those physical stats. Rui Garcia at Leeds. Potentially. Thank you for the bits. 200 more bits from Fabry. Thank you, mate. Uh, let me just look at shit houses again. There's not really too many people on the transfer list right now. Centre backs. Let's have a look. Uh, you got O'Connell. Poor oh, acceleration of 4 to 7. Doesn't fill me with confidence. We'll have a look at you anyway. Uh, Javi Castellano. He's more of, a, more of a midfielder, isn't he? He's 32 and has shit physicals, so nope. I'm a stickler for physicals, I have to be honest. Chris Passion doesn't have very good physicals, so they're not that bad. Don't know. Jordan Clark, we're already looking at him. Asenu Cisse. Nope. Uh, 
And he's not so sort of looked at. No. I'm going to just down to shitters again. Paul Digby used to be a good midfielder back in the day. Good prospects, but not so much anymore. Uh, Borthwick Jackson. Cameron Borthwick Jackson. Uh, yes. I think is a is a good way to phrase that. Uh, let's have a look at right mids. Albert Adoma, quick. What do you want to? What's he on wage? Why is that? Twenty-two. Super Dragon Boy with a second month in a row. Twitch Prime first ever anniversary, longer than a month. As always, miss it. Keep up the great work, man. Uh, have I missed anything on tonight's stream? Nothing other than us watching the Champions League final and looking at people to potentially buy. Thank you for the uh, for the resub, bro. Luke Berry, not really going to sign him as a winger, am I? Josh Brownhill, not really going to sign him as a winger either, to be fair. Uh, 